Now guys, now the biggest thing that people mention to me when they're on about electric cars is that they can't do can't long do journeys. Now what we're doing today is an almost 300 mile journey down south and then of course back again at the end of the weekend. So, Friday afternoon, seven year old, 300 miles. It's gonna be interesting. to go are we, are we ready yes we're good hopefully it'll be a good journey yeah although we do have to use electricity charge points no i know i know all right so we're on the motorway now the m62 traffic's not been too bad so far has it no nope, no nope. so we've got 83 percent left 77 miles until the charge point to the right again um so uh that's enough you're in. Traffic is traffic. It would have been brilliant all the way up until literally joining the A1 and then boom, stopped. So we've done 100 miles with 12% left and we're just over four miles away from the services so we can get something to eat and we can charge. We kept a steady pace. Traffic has pretty much dictated that speed. There's a couple of charges at this one so hopefully we shouldn't have to wait. Yeah, they're there, they're there. What? Is it there? No, they're the Tesla ones unfortunately. We can't use those. <laughs> oh, there's one Tesla there. There's one person charging. Oh, and it's a leaf. It's a leaf. Leaf, leaf. Right, I'll start charging. Okay, do you want to come out? So that's not particularly good services for food, is it, Grantham? No. So we're just getting this to put us on, and then Cambridge services will have, uh, will have something uh, something nicer. Yeah. Mm. We've done 106 miles to get here, and now we're charging, and we started charging on the Ecotricity app, didn't we? Um, but we only did about two or three kilowatts because he left, and that one's on free vend. So we scored a free vend as well, or at least mainly free. And so that's good, good all round. <laughs> you hurt your bum? Yeah. So do you prefer going down in a normal car and only stopping to go to the toilet and eat? Or do you like stopping to charge so you have to stop a bit more in the electric car? Which we, you know, any preference? It's on free vend again. <laughs> oh my god. Is it wonder electricity is still around? Oh, we've done quite well out of that, have we? Another yeah. free vend, which means I've got a Chinese to eat, you've got chicken nuggets to eat, and a marshmallow waffle that you've got. Uh, oh, oh, oh. There goes the knife. No, oh, mm. having to stop at services to charge is such a, a hardship. Okay then, 92%, 80 miles to go now, till we get to Grandma and Grandad. Mm. So we've had two stops, uh, both free vent stops. Can we put something uh, good on now please, because I, I, I can't cope with all these songs. Okay. Something good. So we, we are here, we've arrived. Yeah, so we've, so we've got 15% left, we've, we've arrived and it's taken us about 6 hours 40 minutes uh, which given the traffic on the first half I don't think it's too bad I reckon it had probably taken us 6 hours in the other car because we'd have stopped anyway to have tea so uh... And get waffles! <laughs> 
considering that the entire trip, thanks to a couple of free events, has cost us two pounds. Yeah, we're, we're not far far 300 miles for two quid. We can't charge your grandma and granddads, can we? Because they live over there in a flat. So as they live in the flat and we can't charge here, we're going to have to rely on the charging infrastructure in the town, which is basically a single charger in the car park or an Asda that's got three or four chargers. Well, we're on our way back pretty much and uh, we managed to uh, charge at a local council car park charger, which is uh, near the pier. So the car's on pretty much 100%, about 99%. Uh, so yeah, public charging infrastructure is, uh, is getting better, it seems. I reiterate, we haven't uh, used anything other than public charging infrastructure since we set off from home. So, uh, so far so good. We do have the long journey back now though. It's a Sunday, um, so it should be quiet, but uh, who knows what's going to happen. Right, let's get packed up and ready to go. Right, so we are off back home. Another long journey ahead of us, but... Uh, we... Look at this. Do we think, Alice? Uh, you, you, it's it's an app. It's not a card. Right. Hasn't been a card for a while now. Right. So I couldn't use it with my cards that I've got. Uh, I don't know what, what card you got. But I've got the leaf, but I haven't. Right. I just I use a card. I don't have an app on my phone. Ah, you have to get the app. Unfortunately, you can't use the card anymore. They stopped doing it about a year ago. So the you, card only you works for an the. App, uh... you can't do it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. If you don't have a smartphone, you can't fuel your car. That's 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 the future we live in now. Well, proof, Alice, that uh, someone has an electric car doesn't have a smartphone, so he can't charge his car at motorway service area. I think this will be uh, 70 all the way. Might as well go a bit quicker and just charge for a little bit longer when we're there. Makes us feel a bit better. I think going faster but charging a little bit longer. Even though it might not get you there any quicker, it feels a bit better because you're going quicker. And I guess you're spending more time out of the car then as well. Yeah. Speed limiter, once I get past these roadworks anyway, speed limiter on 70. Because 70 is the speed limit and Daddy never goes above the speed limit. That would be naughty. That would be naughty. Here we are, Grantham again then. That one. If we go economically on the way back, this will be the last charge, but if we go a bit quicker, we'll probably have to do a quick, very quick stop off further up. So I think we'll go a bit quicker this time because we went slower going down. Uh, but this will be a very short, probably five to 10 minute one at Ferry Bridge because obviously we'll be using more energy because we're going quicker. Well, that was a short uh, trip up the A1, about an hour, and we're at Ferry Bridge. Here we are at Ferry Bridge and once again, we're on free vend. I don't think Ecotricity like to actually charge people for using their chargers. So that's uh, five chargers we've visited this weekend and all five have been on free vend. I reiterate, 
that's why there is no investment in the electric highway because they don't charge their customers i reckon you're looking at a 20 25 percent free vend rate if there is such a thing so what's the point in running a network if you're not going to charge people it sounds strange me wanting to pay but ultimately that's what needs to happen just a short uh, charge on this one about 10 15 minutes just enough to get us home there's no point in arriving home with more than we need Oh, and for those with a 40 kilowatt Nissan Leaf, this is what a third consecutive charge at full speed looks like. <laughs> we're back, we're back. We've had to switch cameras because that one's died, but we're back. Six and a half hours to go from Clacton to North Yorkshire. I think that's, that's pretty good. Uh, so yeah, the car's on 13%, three successive charges. It's gone up, it was on 12 before. Yeah, well, it's because we've gone down a big hill benefits of electric car you get a lot of regen in North Yorkshire <laughs> lots of hills so I think uh, I think we've proven without a shadow of a doubt there's no problems at all taking no, the leaf no nope. and the benefits which I've probably mentioned several times already uh, of the financial savings I think more than outweigh the hour hour 15 minutes of time extra time it's taken us to get up here in, in this car so make sure you don't miss any other videos by subscribing to the channel and thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and we'll see you soon. Bye.